Hey, it's me, Kayvon, and correct me if I'm wrong, but am I not your favorite half-Persian comedian? I'm also the most patriotic comedian in America. And one thing I hate is when someone disrespects the troops and the military. And here we have a president doing just that. Most popular president of all time? I don't think so. Check it out. I can only assume that you will enjoy educating your family about how the Coast Guard is, quote, the hard nucleus around the Navy forms in times of war. You are quite, you're a really dull class. I mean, come on, man. Is the sun getting to you? I would think you'd have an opportunity when I say that about the Navy to clap, but, but being here together. Here's what a popular president to our military sounds like. And here's Biden. Understanding what you may hear about me, I have incredibly good judgment. One, I married Jill. And two, I appointed Johnson to the Academy. I just want you to know that. Just clap for that, you stupid bastard. And here's a popular president. And here's a Montauk. For saluting Marines with a cup of coffee in hand. An act that has quickly become known as the Latte Salute. You've got to come and watch this. This was actually a light moment. We just wanted to play it for you. Provide a little a little relief as we are covering all this serious news. You see a Marine alongside Marine One lost his cap. The president goes to help put it back in. It falls off again as he pats him on the side. He goes and he grabs it again. It's so windy, obviously, from the helicopter. He's trying to right the ship here. For years, Joe Biden has been recounting a story of American heroism and heartbreak on the front lines, recently telling a crowd in New Hampshire how he traveled to Afghanistan to pin a silver star on a young Navy captain. And the general wanted me to pin the silver star on God's truth, my word is a Biden. He stood his attention. I went to pin But the Washington Post dug into the story and determined Biden got the time period, the location, the heroic act, the type of medal, the military branch, and the rank of the recipient wrong, as well as his own role in the ceremony. Now, growing backlash in the New York Post and this from Republican Congressman and Afghanistan veteran Dave It is Kershaw. not some people who did something. It's, it's terrorists who killed almost 3,000 Americans. And we should talk about it that way. I made, uh, you know, I uh, made a, a mistake in, in describing it. She claimed she misspoke last week and was sleep deprived when she described landing under sniper fire in Tuzla, Bosnia. The truth can be slippery. I want to apologize. I said I was traveling in an aircraft that was hit by RPG fire. I was instead in a following aircraft. Uh, two of our four helicopters were hit by ground fire, including the one I was in. No uh, RPG and, and AK-47. made a mistake in recalling the event. I hope you liked that video and I have 400 more on youtube.com slash comedy. I hope you'll subscribe. I also have a live tour, which is what I want you to do. Come see my comedy show live. But if you're a stay-at-home comedian lover and you like truth through comedy, waking America up with laughter, there's four ways you can help. You can make a one-time donation on gofundme.com slash comedy or Venmo or Cash App or PayPal. You can leave a comment below for the algorithm, or you can become a member on Patreon or Locals. Either way, I'm coming to your city next. See you there.